Welcome back to the channel, everyone. Hey everyone, Dog Walker Dave here. Today on the channel, I'm going to go over how to download maps using an iOS device to put on your Garmin Phoenix 6. Now, I believe you can use a Phoenix 5 for the same thing, and I'm, but I'm not sure about the 3. Maybe someone can leave a comment below if you can do the same process with the Garmin Phoenix 3. But what I can do is go onto my iOS device. I will show you my iPad, show you the process. It's a very slick and painless process so that you can get turn-by-turn -turn directions when you're out there on the trail. So let's switch over to the iPad and I'll show you how it's done. Here we are on connect.garmin.com. First thing you need to do, of course, is log in. Once you're logged in, on the left hand side here under training as you can see here we select courses so if I select that I open up an area and there are many hiking biking trail running courses already loaded into the connect Garmin website many of them are the same as Strava segments they have Strava segments in them and many are the same as all trails. So I will select one that I've done recently called Forget-Me-Not Ridge. If we select Forget-Me-Not Ridge, it shows me the total distance here. This is an out and back. I can go through it. You can see the elevation here. You can see where, in this case, it's pretty flat for two kilometers and then you gain 700 meters quite quickly. It's considered a trail running course, but it doesn't matter. And all you need to do is if you're in this and there's already a pre-created one, or you can create your own if you want, if you select send to device, it will come up with this prompt. Now, the thing about an iOS device is that you have to deselect Launch Garmin Express because it is not available as an app on iOS it's a Windows based or a, an Apple or Macintosh based program or yeah, I believe it's program. So what you need to do is select the device that you use. In this case, I'm using the Phoenix 6. Then I select send to device. So again, select send to find whatever trail you want to do or create your own trail. Send it to device. Select the device that's in your list in this case I had an old Phoenix 3 that's still there but the one I use is the Phoenix 6 make sure you deselect launch Garmin Express send to device the next time that you sync as it says in the bottom here this course will sync to your device the next time you sync with the Garmin app on your phone the iOS device and that is it. It is that simple to do. And then you can have turn-by-turn -turn directions, which is fantastic to have. Pretty darn easy to use, Garmin. Thanks a lot for that. Thanks for watching, everyone. Consider hitting that subscribe button. That would really help with the channel. Have a great rest of your day. Peace.